hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah, yeah. She had the thing I love. Oh, Where was she from? I don't know. But she was. Welcome everybody. Today we get a chance to chit chat with one of our sponsors, which is. Nicole Brown from Olichi Designs. So I'm gonna wait until everybody gets in and They're supposed to be with us in a second So let's see. Let's see. Let's see Who's gonna join in first? Numero uno Numero dos All right Oh. Hello, hello. Good afternoon, good afternoon, ladies. How y'all doing? Ooh, Sean, hello. hello. <laughs> it's, it's, it's night, though. It's night. Look, look. <laughs> okay, that's true. <laughs> you like want the sun shining? I'm a Caribbean person. Want the sun shining? I, I was going to give the whole spiel now, but I was like, you know what? Let me not. <laughs> oh, wow. so, we only have 30 minutes with our very dear sponsor and nicole yes so yes we'll on into it. Hi. i know i'm so excited really happy to be with you guys <laughs> so let's get let's get on into it let's get on into it how 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 who's you who's nicole <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? So, well, of course, St. Martin, born and raised. Um, oh, oh. If you say who you for, so I for oh, Shirley oh. Brown and Jan Brown. <laughs> Big up back to Shirley, Uncle Jan. <laughs> exactly, exactly. And yeah, so I mean, grew up St. Martin, was 17 years old, then came to the Netherlands. Oh, you know the typical, you come over to your bachelor's, stayed a little too long. I was like, oh, let's do my master's. <laughs> and then I started to do work. And I was like, mm, okay, kid number one, kid number two, and you know, everything. <laughs> so life started to be built. Mm -hmm. No, but I mean, yeah, but for real, I mean, what is it like now? Nearly 18 years based in the Netherlands. And I mean, can't complain. Yes, of course, it's not always the easiest, but, you know, you always have your support system. And for me, I mean, mom to two, a boy and a girl, dog owner, mm -hmm. wife to land. So, I mean, <laughs> life is great. Cat, yes, I know. <laughs> I'm mini Yorkie. A, a lot <laughs> of capes there, but... <laughs> No, so yeah, life gets busy, you know, but I mean, yeah, you have to find those things to, to, to find, you know, the balance. And for me, the balance of, of course, dancing like 14 years and forever dancing to doing it as hobbies still now um, and training. I mean, you know, being with Lance and not being able to train, that's like a no-go. So mm -hmm. <laughs> he is a personal trainer. So mm -hmm. yeah, so definitely a sportive family. And of course, for nice. myself, working at Nike for the past 14 years and still going. Um, yeah, sport and trying to find that balance is a big part of who I am and who we are. So that's a bit me on the personal side. And if you think what else we like to do, barbecuing. I love a good barbecue and chilling with people with good vibes. <laughs> hey, who don't like good vibes? Why exactly. <laughs> Why are you telling me this at the end of summer? I don't yeah, know. well, I was kind of <laughs> looking at some Martin for the summer, so... <laughs> <laughs> I don't, we, we can't you. blame you. We can't blame you at all. <laughs> exactly exactly no but i mean all good you got to make the best of what you have and, and where you're working with and um yeah so that's that that's me i would say and who i follow <laughs> thank you for the introduction i feel like this is a well-rounded introduction <laughs> and uh, just just to rub it in some people's face right <laughs> Let's see, let's see which which team you're rocking. Um, what you what they're saying? What you what you saying there? Um, wait, hold on there. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Sorry, Sean. Sorry, Sean. It seems I feel I feel I feel this is a sexy thing going on. I don't I don't appreciate this, but it's okay. I believe all you have your one point. It's all right. So one point for Team V. So far, and can I just say for Team V? And V, yeah. the T is awesome. The T in the little goodie bag. I tried it today. I thought, what was the best 
you can have any more best opportunity to try it. So I did it today and like right now it is awesome. So it is definitely a keeper. <laughs> Thank you. You see, a lot of people, it was supposed to be secret, but it's not secret a long time anymore because everybody <laughs> like, Vicky, be for when we get some water. <laughs> but like, enough, about me. enough about me. You know, we just had to, we just had to represent. Yeah, yeah. Level set, level <laughs> set. A look, bit. look, look, my mother raised me <laughs> right, okay? Uh, Ladies get the first point. <laughs> Oh my! Let me say, let me say, let me say. Anyway, enough about uh, TV. Tell us more about your business, Ualichi Design. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, business. yes. Love you, by the way. Thank you, thank you. And I think that's exactly mm -hmm. the touch that you'll, you know, continue to see. You know, if you follow us a bit and to see what all we're doing. So, pretty much, let's see. Ualichi Design. Maybe I should start why why I even started with the whole Ualichi Design. <laughs> So as I mentioned, Jan Brown is my dad. And for most of you that know, of course, you know, he worked at the airport and everything, you know, air traffic controlling. But however, on the side, he had a passion where he realized how he can use, you know, some of his skills, you know, for some other fun stuff on the side. And his fun stuff was a construction company. Okay. And with that, so that meant for me growing up for well, over like 20 years, you know, on a construction site in dump trucks mm -hmm. in you know, cement and all sorts of stuff, you know, in, in, um, in primary school, you know, being dropped off to school in a big dump truck. So this was like really cool, you know, <laughs> like who gets dropped off in a big dump truck, right? So no, but I mean, those are the fun times, you know, but I think for me, it was really awesome to see how, you know, you can have something on a piece of paper, you know, someone comes over to you and say, oh yeah, you know, I have an idea. I really think I like, you know, I want to do something, but they really know how to do it, you know, and yeah. seeing how you talk the people through that journey of bringing their vision to life, you know? Um, and, and then all of a sudden you just saw something 3D that's so awesome and so beautiful. I made so many people happy, you know, that their, that their, that their vision came to life. So I think that's for me where it really started, you know, the interest in it. Uh, I took it a bit further a few years ago with interior uh, design uh, as well and this was just literally on the side you know just doing some stuff uh, and then did an up, uh, uploading our course and all of those things to you know go a bit deeper into it to see yeah more the the, the principles and the foundations of it and mm -hmm. yeah and then with that um what, a few years what four years ago now um then built um our own house so that was for me also the, the amazing like let's all pack it all into one and then I was like, okay, look, I, I feel like I have so much to share, you know? So mm -hmm. I really wanted to start sharing that with, yeah, whoever was interested. And it started really slowly and I never really talked about it too much. And I was like, why? Mm -hmm. Why? You know? Exactly. <laughs> and I was um, chatting with a colleague of mine and she, you know, she also talked about, you know, um, hustle and heart and how you keep going for what you want and, I was like, you know what, why not? So this year I decided to officially, like, well, to make it official, you know, and literally mm -hmm. official for me meant going to Chamber of Commerce, making it yeah. official, you know, just really putting it mm -hmm. out there. And for me, the touch of everything that I have and do, of course, you know, you want the, the clean and the sleek, and I'll come back to that in a minute, but mm -hmm. there is still that Uolichi in you you know, this touch of tropics and Caribbean and so on. So mm -hmm. that is, that is, that is, I would say the real distinction piece of it, you know, you can have say, oh, but I like this industrial, oh, but I like, you know, the warm tints and, but how do you actually bring it all together with how that little quality touch, you know, and I figure out, you know, I sort of have a bit of a touch to it. So why not make other people <laughs> happy with it? And it yeah, is. and I mean, to be honest, since then it really picked up quite some and really interested to see, to see how many people are struggling with the same things you know uh, as soon as you open up that conversation they're like oh my gosh I just want to have someone to think about it to brainstorm and yeah so that's sort of the why you behind of it you literally become the house doctor then the interior yeah. doctor <laughs> <laughs> exactly and I think you know and the, the, also the thing is for me as well you know it's not just how you put something pretty down you know, oh, somebody wants, oh, this style, or I went to this store and I see this, I just want to throw something in the house. No, it's more than that, you know, because as I mentioned, you know, I have, not just me, but everyone has so much going on, 
You know, and for me, it really came together when you say you're trying to balance two kids. You have a dog. You have a husband. You want to do a good job. You want to still be a friend and, and, and a daughter and everything. So life gets hectic and busy. So you need to make sure that you have a home that you could come home to and, and recharge. You it's know, fair. exactly. And so for me, the yeah. real core of what we do and stand for is to make sure that someone can come home and feel that they can relax you know, rejuvenate and recharge and go again, you know, and, and, and that, that's what it's all about. And people are like, oh, but what do those three things mean? You know, for me, relax is the fact that you could come home and get rid of all attention. Rejuvenation for me means the ability to have elements in your room, in your mm -hmm. house, in your home that gives you energy. Mm -hmm. And then yes. once you have that energy, what do you do with it? You know, you need to put that back into something creative. So making sure you have spaces to connect with people and, yeah, you know, like just to live. Right? Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Literally, I built my house with the, the ability to be an indoor, outdoor, everyone can fit, loads of people, you know, like literally. But, you yes. know, that's the, and that's what you go through with people, you know, what are you going to use it for? And the one question I always ask someone, what do you want to feel when you come into that space? What do you want to feel? I want to feel like I want to be home. <laughs> you want to be home, but you'll be sometimes surprised of how, yeah, but what does that mean? You know? Mm -hmm. So you really go so deep with people as to what does that mean? Everyone say, I want to feel like I'm home, but what does home mean for you? And how does the home contribute also back to you? You know? Mm -hmm. And so that's the holistic slash the well-being part of what we do. And for me, there's no design that we would put down that does not have a holistic slash well-being concept design to go with the space you know so that's a real critical mm -hmm. um piece so besides the early touch and this whole well-being and holistic that has to go together um and that i think makes us us i would say as early design but but let's let's take it back a, a yeah. second <laughs> So we, we hear vibing on Uolichi, but what is Uolichi? Because ah. people don't know. Yeah. Like, I people from Uolichi self who uh, don't know what Uolichi yeah. is. And I was like, girl, boy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So Uolichi, so if you would go back in, whether it's books or whatever, you know, it's like, oh, yeah, well, how we get the name St. Martin? Well, first of all, you know, Uolichi was also the name given to St. Martin um, by the Indians. And... Yeah, bra brave, strong women, you know, and it's that touch that we bring to it. So, yeah, mm -hmm. Olichi. So before St. Martin became St. Martin, it was already named Olichi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just in case you didn't dig into the history books. <laughs> we got you, we got you. We got <laughs> you. Definitely got you covered here. But I, you, you were touching a bit of it a little um, previously, Nicole. But mm -hmm. like, how, can you go a bit more into the processes you go to when you, like, you, <laughs> you have a customer? Like, do yeah. you have a standard, like, procedure and, like, what, like how you dive in yeah. to, deep with them? How, how do you get in touch with them? Yeah, for sure. And um, it's funny because people say, hey, I want to do it. But at the same time, they're often, how should I say, they're often nervous to make the first step to approach mm -hmm. an interior designer or company because the process feels quite overwhelming. So the first thing that we would always start with, and usually, especially for big, big projects, you just come and have a chat. You know, and that's why you'll see now we have sort of this 20 minutes just so people get over that hurdle of, eh, I don't know, I don't want to. It starts with that chat. And that chat, you can get so much out of it because you go through what is really the frustration, what is the inspiration or aspiration for the space that you're trying to achieve. And in that conversation, you start to pick up stuff. People might feel like they're rambling or they, but as an interior designer, you're picking up so much information, the more they, they, the more that they talk, you know. Um, and then, so you start with the whole idea. And then you go into a bit of the concept phase to say, hey, okay, well, based on all of that, we would set up, say, a Pinterest uh, board together. Mm -hmm. We go through, so we spend a week or two just, you know, throwing back ideas of things that you like. And for me, I already start to see, like, you know, a bit of a, a red thread through the whole thing to say, ah, okay, now I got them. Now I see where, you know, now I see where it's going. And that's, that's, that's the trained eye, you know, the trained eye know how to pick up those different things. You think you're just spewing out all of the, everything you have and soul. And they're like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Exactly. 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 Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> and then so once you go through that, then I go really into the I mentioned the the, the concept phase. And for me, the concept phase is how do we make sure we'll get the holistic slash the well being design correct. Um, I will then summarize and structure all of the thoughts that you had before uh, and really put forward a proposal uh, in terms of what I think we can go for. So this is an inspiration board, mood boards, you know, where you can get a feeling for the direction that we would go into. Um, and then the process after that is saying, hey, OK, well, is this enough? And this is say the something smaller package, we would call it. And then you say, hey, OK, well help me get started, you know? So I, I like it, but help me get started a bit more. So where we will go into here then next is to say, hey, okay, well, if you want to personalize it more, you have a floor plan. Then you have um, space and conversations of mm -hmm. what you can do with it. Uh, and then usually we also try to render as well what the room would look like. Some rooms might oh. need it. Some rooms might not. But yeah, so the rendering is where we... like a, a, a jargon thing. Tell yeah. them what <laughs> no, exactly. <laughs> so the whole 3D rendering. So pretty much um, mm -hmm. some people can not feel or see if something is flat. So pretty much we make it a bit 3D. Let's put it that simple. You know, so it's really a 3D yeah. look and feel of what the room could or would look like. Exactly. Yeah. I love that part because <laughs> sometimes, it's, sometimes you're talking about different things with like... You, I'm hearing you say it, but I just can't see it. Yeah, I just exactly. can't see it. Yeah, so exactly. Yeah. That that yeah. aspect of you actually making it into a 3D model and be like, okay, here you go. This is what the room, <laughs> what my vision is for the room. I think exactly. that is so fabulous. Yeah. So then that's that's I mean that that's really the starting point. That you give people the confidence that they can kick off, they can do something, uh, and then you know you give some instruction instructions of how they could bring it to life potentially. Um, this is then the help me get started package. Then the other package is pretty much the same, but then it's built out a bit further where people say, okay, well, love it, but kind of help me halfway. Just help me a that little bit extra, Another you know, <laughs> just help me halfway, a little bit more there. And then that halfway piece is where you say, hey, okay, well, this is the shopping list that you can go for. Because sometimes people don't know where to go to get the products or how to go about it. So then you really oh. create a, a clickable, like literally, where it's an Excel sheet, a PowerPoint, that the people can just literally click on that link and you can just drag and drop your product into the basket, to be honest. Um, and then you can see overview of the cost, that you get a bit of feeling for it. Does it fit my budget? Does it not? And sometimes, yeah, we can even say, hey, um, provide some samples where possible. Depending if someone wants to redo a bathroom or so on, we can provide the samples uh, for those. Um, yeah, and then even here, sometimes we tend to tag on a... Uh, um, you want to go shopping with me or help me shop and do the shopping. <laughs> so this is also sometimes the addition that people tend to, uh, to ask for. But um, yeah, it, it's very, again, very fluent. The, the most important is that we take a lot of the overwhelming feeling away from the process, you know, and keep people structured, keep them that they, that they feel that they can keep, they, they can continuously move forward, you know, uh, instead of just spinning in circles and circles. And that's a, that's a help me halfway. And then there is the, the grand finale package, which is oh, the please no. take it off my plate. Please yep. take it off my plate. <laughs> That's one I would be taking because... I was, just, I was just going to say, I was like, Sean would be like, no, give me that last package, please. Exactly. That's me. <laughs> you keep saying like, I don't know how you create it, do it, blah, blah, blah. While well, exactly. I'm really angry as well, but you're like, oh, I, do not, I do not compute. No. <laughs> and to be honest, there's no shame in this last package because Even life was, is too you. busy. <laughs> <laughs> and, and life is too busy, you know. So, when, I mean, it's, it's, it's a lot, especially depending on the size of the project, to go and have to go talk to a painter, to go talk to somebody Yo. to do wallpaper, to go talk Yo. to somebody to demolish, you know, all Yo. of these things. <laughs> you don't want to have all of that, you know? So then we say, okay, well, look, if once you sign off on the final design and the package, we can then take all of that on for you. Um, yeah, and all you have to do is just show up at the final grand and voila. <laughs> That's so good. I feel like you can start off with that. <laughs> <laughs> Halfway. I don't want to halfway. I just want to show up. I want to be like, I want to be in one of those makeover shows. Exactly. That, that's exactly what I'm going to feel like. Yeah, yeah that's, that's me. Just give me any result. Point A, point B. No, no, no. Uh, I don't know. The first time I do that, one the person walking, they was like, okay, 
to, do we have to scream move that bus how are we gonna do this now? <laughs> <laughs> I was like wow I didn't even think on that one <laughs> so, I mean yeah. you really have fun with it you know you just have fun with it and people just they, yeah they enjoy it so yeah <laughs> That, that person will watch a little too much TV, but it's okay though. I, I like that idea. If I, I'm sorry, but when I heard that sentence, I went like, "Yeah, <laughs> if you don't know, if you don't know, you know. If you know, you know. If you don't know, you don't know." But yeah. Oh, my. but yeah, so that's yeah. Those are some of the packages. Okay. I was looking at one of your uh, recent reviews, and I had that same feeling, like, "Oh my god." Exactly. So, I can't even imagine for for all of your clients who actually get to go through that and I'm like, girl, I got your number. <laughs> indeed, <laughs> indeed, indeed whenever, whenever. So, yes, anybody in the live, you have any questions for Nicole, this is your chance, okay? <laughs> Don't wait too long. Yeah. You have long. So, yeah. if you have any questions for Nicole, post them here in the live and we'll be sure to get to it. Yeah. But um in the meantime, in between time, let's see. What what do you feel like is is like your thing? What is your your design, your iconic design yeah. style? Yeah, mm. I would say my the the touch, uh, or like I say the final touch. I'm not sure if you've seen on the so on my Instagram, you'll see it really. It's really that the tropics element. Um, but why the tropics? Because the tropics, it's, it's, it's not just the Caribbean, you know, it's this color palette that this whole tropical band on earth brings to us. So whether it's these rusty colors from the desert or like the Saharas or whatever, or the really, the, the blue crystal blues from, from the Caribbean's, the greens, you know, and, and then finishing like touches like this, what you see in the back of me. You know, I would just love to say, let's take a reference to your <laughs> <laughs> exactly, exactly. And then, you know, the final touches of that, and like a bit of the antiques, you know, of course, no real room is finished without a nice, sexy antique piece in it. But, um, yeah, you know, so it's just really those those pieces that I think brings home that, uh, that again, the, the tropics and the the, the Uolichi touch to it, I would say, um, that comes through. Yeah, and I think a lot of them so far that we've seen, and even 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 my place, it's the, the basic starts with say the, the the sleek concept, the modern designs, um, <clears throat> with the simplicity of say the Scandinavian ish, you know, this clean topic, but with a warm touch again, you know, of the the early yeah. tea and the, the a bit of the antique pieces in between, so. And it's not like MTV as an old looking. No. It really looks like, I don't know, it really looks designer. Let me say it that way. <laughs> it looks really designer. It's not like when you hear antique, people think like, yeah, but I'm yes. that type. Yes. When you get little touches in between, it's like, ooh, child, mm, okay. <laughs> and they're yeah, so subtle. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. They're so subtle. Like you, you're like, oh, it's, it's like a double take sometime or you, you realize it the, when your eye keeps scanning the room. It's like, Oh, and it keeps coming back to that spot, you know. So that that's usually the the the, the catch in the whole room, usually. So if if I could ask, how how do you look for suppliers and to, to keep up that whole like Walichi <laughs> style and and like that like whole atmosphere? Yeah, yeah, that is a very good question, Sean. Just try, hunting, 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 because I think, and that's why, um, let's say this year didn't really help because everything you know the lockdowns and the this mm -hmm. and the that all of those things but i think with um the what do you call the trade shows the version that they did that they tend to have uh, here um mm -hmm. sticking also in contact a lot of the sources also not just in holland to be honest um you know for me source of inspiration and so on comes from australia from italy from the caribbean you know and also working yeah, working together with other people to understand, do we have the products in Holland or not? Or do we bring them together here? Um, and as simple as the little paint shop around the corner, you know, don't mm -hmm. underestimate a lot of your local guys where they are so much more passionate. And even if they don't have it in stock, believe me, because you have that relationship, they're willing to, they're willing to, to bring that I together know for you. Yep. You know, so I think it's that combination of, um yeah finding those those guys and of course then not underestimating trader hans winkles 
you know, those secondhand stores. <laughs> mm -hmm. And also picking up a lot of stuff that you think sometimes even when you go back home to some and people think, oh, yeah, but this thing, well, me one, it's no more. Uh, well, I'll take it off your hands because I know something sexy you can do with it. Yes. You know, so it's it's moments like these as well. Um, yeah, that you just sort of save and stuff and you just find a place later on for them. Circular life. That is true. <laughs> one, one thing when I was talking to you um, earlier, well, not earlier, not today earlier, mm -hmm. but as in <laughs> before this earlier, and we we're talking about the whole sustainable aspect of your your business as well. Yeah, I really, really love that because I'm like, okay, so I I like to be as you know protective of the earth as possible without sounding like a tree hugger. Yep. But, <laughs> um, <laughs> I mean, if you all hug trees, you all hug trees. It's okay. <laughs> I see. I might not hug a tree, but I might, you know, hug a, hug some leaves like coming into the fall. I feel like that is is very one with nature. <laughs> yeah, you're happy with the, like, you're happy with the tree, not... but you lose me with the leaves. <laughs> No, but you see, in my mind, in my mind, that is so much fun. But when I think about all the bugs in there, like, ah, nah. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't hear about you. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but I think, yeah, like you say, you know, I try to, it, it's it's a very tough, he like you say, the, it's, there's more and more focus on it mm -hmm. because everyone thinks, oh, but I need to get the latest. Oh, I need to get the greatest. Oh, it needs to be fresh. And then, yeah, well, it can be to a certain extent, but even that, I think just starting with the, lit, the smallest awareness of, you know, where your products come from, you know, using paint, because um, I use, a, a, we work together with a guy investing in uh, here in Barn, not, not too far down in Barn, where, you know, they, they try to minimize or reduce all of the chemicals that's in the paint um, and mm -hmm. or create um, that it goes back to sort of goodwill uh, in terms of, you know, creating water supply for certain countries and things like this, um, or like I mentioned, you know, the, the ability to recycle. Um, um, yeah, whether it's antiques or just products, you know, you come in, you do a room and someone says, oh yeah, but this table got to go and this 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 cupboard have to go. It's like, okay, that's your feeling. Well, let's see, you know, let's explore it first. Well, yeah. Exactly, that you can sort of just minimize, um, yeah, just, just be a bit more yes. aware on yes. the circular life and um, yeah, just the health aspects, I would say, of the products that you use as well, so. Mm. Exactly. I really love that you pay attention to the little details because we don't usually tend to think about, oh, yeah, but when you paint in the fumes that that those things emit, you know, yeah. and especially if you're doing kids rooms you, or if kids somebody rooms. is having a bun in the oven mm -hmm. or, you know, yeah. if they have somebody on the way, you don't want to you don't want to you want to pay attention to those things. Exactly. But even exactly. if you don't, actually, <laughs> even if you don't. Yeah, well, I, I love that. Thank I love that. Thank you. Thank you. But um, mm -hmm. any last things? I see. You, I'm like, I feel like why? Why are we doing a half an hour? Only <laughs> <laughs> flew by. Flew by. Bye, yeah, bye. Next time we could do some tips. We could pick a room and we could do some tips on the rooms. <laughs> Yeah, somebody we can have followers come in and be like, "Hey, you know, you want to take a frustration here on live? Let's do this." <laughs> Oh no, but yeah, really. Um, anytime. Any for, for okay, because we're ready. We're already almost out of time. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. But uh, what is the main reason why why you decided to jump on? Because you were one of the first sponsors to hop on board in the first set, the the first cluster, mm -hmm. and I'm like, this girl on on board. But why you decided to be like, <laughs> let me just go for this. Let me you just know, do this. You know, to be honest, I was just. I found the concept was so damn interesting because mm. a lot of time and it, it just made me think on all the times that I was like, oh, yeah, no, I'll just do this for this one. I'll just do this for this one. Yep. And it reminded me of a conversation that I had with my colleague. She was like, well, if you shit that good, then get paid for it. Like, show be, and it's not just the it's not the aspect of getting paid because I need money or I gotta get it out. It it's ain't the that it, of it. exactly, but it's just yep. showing and it confirms your worth. You yeah, know? it confirms your worth and what you should be doing. You know, um, yeah. So I just thought the concept was so brilliant, and you know, I think we just have to get so much more comfortable one supporting each other, but first of all, talking mm -hmm. about it. Talking yes. about 
talking about making money, but also investing money. Yep. You know, so I think, and this Definitely. is a start to it. In in order for you to invest later on, you have to be able to make money first mm -hmm. to invest. Exactly. So, and this is why I find you know, you guys, what you guys are doing is, is just so brilliant and it just starts to touch something so critical. So just love, love the whole purpose of yes, it. Yes, thank, thanks a lot for that, yeah. for the confidence yeah. you have in us. So. Yeah, definitely. We really appreciate it, for real. Yeah. Because a lot of sponsors are, or not a lot, I would say, because everybody's like, when they hear the concept, they're like, oh, what? You actually mm -hmm. just gonna bring this out here just like boom, bam, raw, just like that? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. We exactly. This is what we're doing, and we ain't shame about saying, you're getting charged. Mm -hmm. and, uh, <laughs> And really start getting that ball rolling within the community. And again, it's so good to have you on board as one of those businesses in the community that people should know about. And we are like, thank you. you. <laughs> like, look at people, go check her out because, yes, yeah. her it is that good. Okay. <laughs> and, and you see, campaigns like this is exactly what we're trying to do because even me, I didn't even know you was doing this, Nicole. Is when, is when V come in and bring everything across <laughs> to me, I was like, wait. Such and such, Nicole. She was like, "Yeah." I was like, "Wow." I had a serious. I was like, "Sean, Sean." I was like, yeah. "Oh yeah, Sean, yeah." I was like, "I still team Vito." I go, I, I go, I go, I go, I go, I go take that slide a little bit because we go way back. I go, I go take that one. But either way, we still highly appreciate it, and thank we you. thank you a lot for joining in. No, really good initiative, guys. Love it a lot, and thanks for thanks for having me today as well. Definitely, <laughs> you are most welcome. Well, y'all, this is this has been way too short. This has been way too short, but it's an introduction into getting to know. Uh, the businesses and also the business owners behind the businesses within our community because that is the most important aspect within our community and um, I, I'm sure that there are so many more so if you know anybody who you like listen you need to know this person or that person because they got uh, uh, an awesome business going on we spoke to um, Nicole from Olichi Designs today Listen, it could be your friend next. It could be you next. So holla at one of us and we, we, we hook you up. Yes, yes. <laughs> I agree. And one more time, Nicole, let them know, let the people let them know where they can find you, yes, how they can get in contact with you. Yes, you can contact me. Well, for sure, on uh, you can follow us and all of the, the cool stuff that we're doing and you can see everything that we've been doing on uh, on Instagram. So that's sort of the main place where you could follow us on OLT Design and check mm -hmm. out the website, com for much more information, projects, whatever. And of course, you can just hit me up for the 20 minute chat if you wanna go more deeper into anything or questions. I am exactly. here. <laughs> yeah, please, please do not be contacting me. Oh, to find me. No, 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 no. <laughs> We're straight to Nicole. We're going to leave the post information here. We need to design, yes? Go get that, listen, go get that 20 minute call and it'll hook you up. Okay, so don't come to me asking me all type of. I'm like, I'm, I'm just be like, there you go. <laughs> there. Don't be shy, don't be shy. Exactly, Nicole doesn't bite, so don't be shy. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, thank Thanks, you again guys. for joining us. And um, any last words for anybody? See you no, guys. I soon. think that's it. We just, somebody on, we had a comment saying make sure that. The, um, her business is pinned but i believe we kind of went through that but we'll make sure to have it in the description as well so that's not a problem again thank you everybody for joining in who has been in thank you nicole again yeah. for you know <laughs> gracing us with your presence yes thank you guys <laughs> you are most welcome yes her business will be sorry for the noise her business <laughs> will be uh tagged in this live okay so make sure that you check it out her information is going to be there. Again, go straight to her. Straight <laughs> to her. <laughs> Later. Bye-bye. Right, Have a good night. Later. <laughs>